Okay, this video is about, so I'm going to tack this on the end of uh, doing a software update, but this video is about how to repair disk permissions on a Mac. Basically, you want to do this um, whenever you install something or whenever you do a software update. And uh, what happens is when you install something or a software update, sometimes it changes the file permissions and you want to change them back to make it run optimally, keep, keep it you know running smoothly and speedy and all that good stuff. So basically, you uh, want to go into, you can just click on the background image, go to Go, and then go to Utilities. And in here, you're going to look for uh, Disk Utility, right here. Click on Disk Utility, and then it's going to come up, and then you're going to click on the HD. It's us it usually says Macintosh a HD, unless you've changed the name. I've changed the name. Um, and it's usually right under the one up top. Usually it has a, you know, this says how large it is, and then this below, this is the one you want to check on, the one that's indented a little bit. And then you just simply click on Repair Disk Permissions. And it'll go through its thing, and uh, it'll show you, it'll tell you what it's changed or whatever and write down and it says right here how long it takes to, to finish and eventually it'll say uh, complete or disk permissions finished or whatever okay so it's a very very simple process and you always want to do this whenever you either install something or update the software or anything like that okay uh, there's no need to wait and uh, watch this because it's really not much to see it's just gonna list a whole bunch of stuff maybe if there's not much to, to change then it won't really change much um, see it here's what it's changing or here what it's changed and eventually it'll say in bold just like this it'll say there we go permissions repair complete okay so that's pretty much it that's all I need to do and if you have other like external hard drives that you also have like a volume on the, that you boot up from that you use you might want to use do that as well okay like this one actually this one is uh, not what I'm using right now. This is the one I'm using right now. So this is this is my real hard drive. This is the one that has Tiger on it. Then I have Leopard down here. So I click on Leopard, and so I'm doing both my hard drives. This is my external, and this is my regular. And I click on Repair Disk Permissions here, and uh, it's going to do the same thing for Leopard. Okay, and it's going to do the same thing. It's going to give me a whole bunch of things what it what it did, and then eventually it'll say uh, finished or complete. All right, pretty simple, pretty easy, and that's the way to do it. And remember, if you like the video, go ahead and click on subscribe to support the site. And also, don't forget to rate the video. Even if it's a three or four, it still helps.